AMA News 11. Good morning, everyone. Thank you for joining us here on Sunrise. Glad to have you with us. I'm Cole Johnson. And I'm Melissa Zaremba. And welcome back, Cole. Thank you. Thank you so much. Good to be here. But we begin this morning with some developing news, an update on the fire in Sealy that started yesterday morning. It has burned about 200 acres and is still burning at this hour. However, Imperial County fire crews say at least 40% of the blaze has been contained. Our reporter Wiley Jahari was at the scene of the fire throughout the early morning and gives us an update. Yeah, that's right. You can see behind me just a few steps from where I'm standing some of that fire which crews are attending to, but some spots more heavier than others. Take a look behind us as well. That is really the situation here in Sealy. About 80 homes have been evacuated and left without power. The deputy fire chief telling us if you're still here, it's time to go. Remember that the property could be replaced and a life can't. Uh, we did have one injury of one firefighter today. Uh, fortunately enough, he was seen and released uh, with the second degree burns uh, to, to his body, 7% of his body. Um, and that's the last thing that we want, right? We, we want to protect life. We don't want it. We want to minimize the, the injury piece of it. Uh, help us out as much as possible by following the orders and recommendations uh, of your officials. If you're asked to evacuate, evacuate. Um, we can deal with the property afterwards. And some of those residents who have been asked to evacuate are sitting waiting at an elementary school in El Centro where they're being taken care of. It is unclear as to when evacuations will be lifted. But for the latest on this fire, you can stay with us at KYMA.com. Reporting from Sealy, 